this one is a bit of luck. It will go all the way over. That's going to be four runs. We've got that out of the, out of our system. We can go all the way. This is a nice little shot. Gets the swivel on it. But uh, hasn't really clicked. You didn't see him clicking first day. And now you're starting to see what he can do. And Ireland uh, goes high up in the air. And there's nobody back there at long on. It, off this over. And this one's high up in the air as well. Fielder comes across and takes what is an outstanding catch. Now, this is brilliant. So they make that field change after Cambodge gets the boundary in that area. And straight away, well, Cambodge, he doesn't shy away. It's an interesting one. This one is close. Skinner takes a good long look at this one. Does the umpire, but Chandani will have to go for what is a two-ball duck. Rico, what's your opinions on this one? This one hooping in. Of just, uh, well, 92 of something. It was something like 20. Asim, the hat-trick man comes in. And, well, he could start with a wicket straight away, could he? No, he's actually going to go. I think this will go all the way. This might be six runs. We'll have a look at this. And the reason why this might be six, I'll tell you, people, because the wind has picked up. If the wind has caught hold of this, which I suspect it has, it's a bit of a naughty game. Okay, this one is out of here. Here we go all the way. Ball. 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 In now, Sonash. Down the ground, and he gets it through the two fielders. This is out on the onside. So chase on for the fielder. Will he get the slide in? No, uh, he can't get there. Looks like a doctor fool. Chance and oh, that is taken beautifully. So, look, when we say that these two, the two Alul's eyes, are sensational in the field, we're not joking, people. We know what cricket. So, could catch 59 for three. Now, I've been asking for well, not I, but people in the air. Well, this is uh, this is going to be easy because uh, Sandy is not going to drop this, is he? Yeah, it's, uh, it's another wicket that goes down, and it's a very easy catch. Well, this is going to go all the way to the boundary. It's a good way to finish the over. Some good from him and some bad. This is played away nicely. It's going to be four runs. That's a delightful shot. The field of us being bowled out is slim. So let's do this. Let's go out there and go boom. Shaka lagya. Because this is what you've got to do. And that's exactly what these two are trying to do here. Is that slower ball, but he overcooks it, does Mustafa. You know, to move from that angle, it doesn't matter though, because this is up in the air, it's long, it's big, it's Maximo time! Make that two in the over, and what an over it is, and that's one way to get yourselves back into this game. Conversation <laughs> with the seam. Oh, oh, well, this is out for a moment. Well, I'll tell you what, the fielder there has had a conversation with the seam as well, the seam that he holds in his hand. I thought you were saying conversation with the seam, as in... Well, that's hit well, and that's going to give you four runs. He hits this in that backward point area. Legal and wicket. <laughs> and uh, Riaz will go. And it's uh, yeah, it's not uh, the largest of celebrations. I think Mustafa knows that he's uh, he's been off the ball in this uh, this uh, this time around. Oh, he's hit this down the ground straight to the man. Oh, he's put it down. He's taken a ripper early on, but this one a clanger straight at him. Shouldn't need it to have really moved. And while well, Mustafa probably would have felt he should have had another. The guy who took. One of the, the classiest catches you'll see earlier. They've only had two singles to start. Well, this one round the corner. And this is going to be a boundary, so that will help Hakimi. Okay, then what's the response? Down the ground, six. That's brilliant batting from Hakimi. And Jinsen Ipu, he's under a lot of pressure now because he's gone for back-to-back -back boundaries. It's four and a six. Yeah, big time. And now this is over us and over our heads. This is on our heads. Oh, just behind us, and it's another Maximo. It's back to back here in Dresden, and Hakimi has joined the party. And he misses out on it. They're running, and well, that's uh, good work from the wicket keeper there. Shubham Patil keeps his cool, rolls it in, gets the run out. They won't get another, but they're going to finish on 123, thanks to that uh, super last over and uh, Hakimi. Well done to him, finishes 34 of uh, 15 deliveries.
I know one or two of you may be saying, hey, we can't hear you, we can hear you, but there uh, might be one or two issues here, but we'll, I'll keep talking. Shubham Patel. Yeah, started well. Oh, that's a blazing shot, isn't it? Oh, I'm liking this. You're, you're a pretty happy chap now, aren't you, fella? Oh, and rightfully so, because we're watching some beautiful displays of power hitting this one into the onside and a lovely looking shot. This one gets dragged a little too. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, I tell you what, you've been eating the eggs. It's a tough, tough one, this one, isn't it, to call at the moment. But with shots like this, you'd argue that the BCA are going to look to chase this down in quick time. I think it's just got a little bit more muggier. And well, now he goes down the down the ground. He hasn't got all of it, though. Oh, yeah, there we go. Eventually, Sammy Cambodge, on what felt like the sick time of lasting, has taken the catch, and it will be the end of Patil. And Chinatibu has come into the oh. attack, and he started with a crunch into the onside. What a start. <laughs> what a hit this is. What's the change going to be? It's Fuller up in the air. Chance, he's there again. Oh, no, but this time he puts it down. This time he can't take it whatsoever. He still doesn't take it cleanly in either of them. But this one gets shelled, and that is not a man you want to drop. Dropped on six off the second delivery. Oh dear, oh dear. And now he's going to go down the ground again. Goes for the more lofted option, does Richmond Thinner, but the skipper underneath it has no idea where it ends up. And uh, well, they'll end up coming through pretty nicely for two. Oh, well, he leads into this, and this goes all the way, does it? Yep. Bully, bully, bully. Ginna Sora. Shaka Lugia. That's what you wanted these batters to do. It's in the slot again. He gets right under it. This will go all the way as well. Manos. Riva, 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 Vidro. Porque eso es seis carreras. Yeah, what a shot. Ah, oh, full toss. This could be called. It will be called. And this one is going to be a seven up. Yes, it is. <laughs> I really don't care. I'm 66 for one now. On. Make that 72 for one because, uh, well, this is uh, this over. Oh, my word, is it a long one? High in the air, big. And it will probably go. Oh, no way. No way. Let's have a look. This. Let's have a look. Where is he? Where's the feet? Keep an eye on the feet here. So, oh. yeah, foot touches the line. The foot touches the rope. Otherwise, we would have seen one of the all-time greatest catches because he takes it and then just there he gets rid of it. Six runs. Says good That's mass, maybe. And okay, he's a measured shot and he's placed it beautifully. And you can see all the stats, not just for the series here, but also for what's happening in the Netherlands as we see another one blasted. Swept. In the gap, I think. It is. He's kicked it over anyway. That will be four. So Vishwan Arthur getting involved and saying, anything you can do, Sandan, I can uh, I can go as equally as well. Otherwise, gone. Got him. And you can see there that Chitanipu knows that that is nothing to do with the way he's played and got about it because that one just stays low from Nan Kumar. And the skipper turns around and says, yeah, no worries, gents. I'll come through and get us that little bit of luck that we may just need because he goes for 47. An inside source as this is pulled and it'll find the gap and it will split the field and go for six. Good shot. Zula will say, so what? I'll clear him. And he does try and clear him. And he will quite easily. It's six more. Down the ground and it will go all the way. Manos arriba, arriba, arriba. Well, this one, I think, uh, ends up in the tower. And this one, cloth down the ground. Oh! Yes, baby. Yes, baby. Well, he had the chance of taking one earlier. Well, now, well, Sandeep Kambodge has taken a one-handed Jalebi wonder catch. This was absolutely blasted. It really was. What a catch. Oh, yeah. And this one, though, is going to go all the way. So even though we've seen something sensational in the catching, that, what's that going to do? That's going to level the scores, I believe. And uh, let's work this out. Now they're going to be just one behind. What sort of a...
tactics you're going to talk about here. There's a ball. There's so many balls to come. You need one. Oh, this time he is out. Oh, you could not write this. He was out of the free hit bolt, and then he absolutely smashes it. And Grover takes a cat. So another wicket go. Chad Aluzai will go after smashing one big ball for six. Want to win? And this should be it. So it's an emphatic run chase from... Uh, the Berlin Cricket Academy. So BCA, they get another win. They're reigning champions. And, well, very much like we saw in last year's final, the Berlin Cricket Academy are able to chase down the runs that RC Dresden get. This time round, it's not a 10-wicket victory, and this time round, it's not a low-scoring one. They had to get to 124, and they do it. And they do do it quite comprehensively.